Hi guys, uh, welcome, sorry about that. We're back and in Kenya, in the Maasai Mara. There's a big grey bottom looking at us. My name is Brent Leo Smith, and I have uh, the dimpled, dangerous Dave Eastall on camera with me. How are you, Dave? I'm oh, very well. We've been trying to get down to this area for quite some time. It's called the Samaki Swamp. But even though we, we can get quite close on the opposite bank, we really, really, it takes quite a long time to get down here. So we left extra early after lunch and uh, came down to the Samaki Swamp. And there we go, we've got some Defasa waterbuck uh, with a buffalo bull in the background. You can very much see the, the, the white bottom as opposed to the ringed white bottom there. Remember, this is 100% live from Magical Kenya, hashtag Safari Live on Twitter if you want to ask us questions, whether it be about the waterbuck's bottom or the elephant's bottom, because it seems that's what we're showing you to start the safari. Bottoms and bums everywhere. Now, as we go across the swamp. There we go. There's a nice big bull next to us. I've actually been, I've seen up to sort of 150 to 200 elephant on the swamp before from a distance, but today there's probably around, I don't know, 50 or so. Oh dear, I put my communication device in the wrong pocket, didn't I Dave? And I apologize for funny noises you might have heard. So there we go. There's a nice big herd of elephants over there. Oh, sorry, monitor. Um, and there's a huge group of water birds just to the right. There we go. There's a uh, great white egret, uh, woolly neck stork, uh, sacred ibis. Also there you can see their curved bills and the great white egrets, the woolly neck stork off to the right. And if we look quite carefully, every now and then there's a single African open billed stork there as well. Now there's two reasons we've come to this vast edge of the Samaki Swamp. Oh, there's a topi there in the background too. Hello, topi. So lots and lots happening here. Now, as I said, there's two main reasons we've come to this area. One is, of course, just these elephants in the swamp is just too beautiful. And I do love myself some lovely afternoon elephant action. And you can see they're really enjoying the nice green grasses and sedges and reeds that are growing out of the Samaki Swamp. Samaki means fish in Swahili, for those of you who are wondering. But now, Dave, if we, if we come back across to this side, now we've seen lots of cheetah, lots of hyena, lots of lions, only one leopard. So we actually haven't really looked for leopard too much, but we've basically driven, let me just figure out, on the edge of this tree line, oh where's my hand gone, on the edge of this tree line all the way around. Keep show everyone where we went, Jeff, all the way around. See, there we go. And we've been hoping, and this is about the closest we can get into the forest, um, that we might spot a leopard lounging in a tree. Alas, no luck yet, but we've still got a fair way to go down to back towards the sort of west and back along the edge of the forest. I think we might have a river crossing. That's hopefully it's not too deep. It doesn't look like too many people have been into this area yet, but who knows, a spotted leopard cat could be hiding somewhere around here. Oh. Oh. Sorry, Megs, you just have to repeat. I'm getting very soft comms from you. Ah, look there. There's one of the residents of the Mara, uh, the buffalo. They don't migrate much. They hang around these swamps. All oh, the birds are taking off. Oh, they're down again. Sometimes the elephants chase them, it is very, very pretty. Now, and there we go. You can see some of the, the birds a little bit more clearly. Now, Violet is wondering, when can we expect the great migration to start? <gasps> well, Violet, I've got some news. Violet, as of two days ago, I heard there were about 20 kilometers to the south in the Serengeti. And, uh, which means they could arrive as early as the 1st of June, more likely around the 15th of June to Silas, which is about 70 kilometers to the south of there. And we've got camp, uh, we've got a tents there where we'll, some of us will be based during the migration. So fingers crossed they're gonna arrive early. I'm excited, aren't you guys? Now, of course, before the migration arrives, we've got such and a myriad of wonderful residents in the Mara. Uh, the Topi, the Tommy, the Grants, the elephants, the buffaloes. And of course, one thing we haven't really managed to focus on too much is the birds. So I think I'll try to find you some new bird species today. I think all of those is intermediate egrets, uh, sacred ibis, mm, black-headed heron. Where did the black-headed herons gone? 